Well, this is the kind of match every football fan looks forward to. A lot on the line and the likelihood of a tension-packed occasion. Stay tuned, we'll have all the action for you live here on EA TV. Hello, here we are at Stadium Australia, part of the Olympic Sports Complex here in the great city of Sydney. I'm your match commentator, Derek Ray, at the microphone. And sitting alongside me is the former Arsenal, West Ham and Coventry midfield player, Stuart Robson. And what we have to look forward to is action from the round of 16 stage here at the 2023 Women's World Cup. It's the Netherlands and they take on South Africa. Absolutely, this should be a good game. I think both sides deserve to be here, but whichever team plays to their full potential should make it into the quarterfinals. It's going to be a good game. Here's the starting 11 for the Netherlands. Well, the two wide players are great in 1v1 situations and their movement is also very good. But it's the midfield three that will need to control the flow of the game. And the lineup for South Africa. Well, the 4 4 2 system relies on good combinations all over the pitch. The front two, the central midfield pairing, the fullback and winger, and of course the centre backs. If you can get these combinations right, you'll have a good team. And so the match is underway. Matlou, Rafilo Jane, well, can they exploit the space out wide, cross fired over, oh that is extraordinary, true athleticism to make contact in that fashion and it's one of the finest goals you're ever likely to see, simply stunning. Well, here it is again, and all you can do is admire the skill. That's a really clever goal, you have to say. And the ball moving again. What sort of response will we see from them now? And a timely intervention. It should be. Well, still an issue here. And I think the threat has been averted. I must say, this looks promising. It might be. Well, the keeper is happy. The bar was there. Vital intervention. Well, it looked highly promising, but they got nothing out of it. Well, had that gone in, they would be in complete control of this game. As it is, they're still going to be a bit nervy. Wonderful challenge and a throw-in coming up. Oh, 
Well, they've won the ball back quickly. Mokhalo. Kasperai. Now with Grunen. Intense pressure. Well, possession seeded by the Netherlands. And they'll get ready for the throw-in. Linda Mokhalo. Jane. She's made a really important challenge. Careless once more in possession of the ball. And she moves the ball with intent. Is it going to be? Able to clear the danger, at least for now. Linette Berenstein. Victoria Pelova. An awful lot of green space to run into. Poor pass. Seo Posenwe. Promising looking ball. Oh, it's there for her. And a goal! They're going to take some stopping now. Two in front here. Well, let's see this again. This is counter-attacking football at its very best. And just look at that finish. 1v1 against the keeper, and she hits it with power. It's a great goal. So underway once more. 2-0 the lead here. Now, who can she pick out? The delivery towards the back post. Well, able to survive that attacking push. Badenstein. And a fine tackle. Not a great pass. Martins couldn't hang on to it. Germain Seoposenwe. Cezanne. Well, there is going to be stoppage time, but only the one minute. And delivered towards the back post. And it goes! Well, it's one goal after another. A highly impressive performance. Well, here it is again. And what a perfect cross into the box this is. Just inviting someone to attack it. And it ends up with a fairly simple finish. Certainly not much the goalkeeper can do about that. And so it is, the first half story has been written. So back underway and an intriguing second half in prospect. Determined defending. Moving forward effectively. Play towards the back post. Unable to keep the ball that time. Takes the shot. And a body in the way. Yeah. 
Jane. And successfully cut out. Van der Donk. And play holds it, free kick given. Here it is now, a substitution. Into the advanced position. Is she going to score? Counter-attacking, very much an option. Opportunity it is. Still a chance. Not out of the woods yet. Off the post and back in play. And the keeper had the measure of it. Trying to pick out a teammate. Now oh, that would be straightforward for any keeper. Rafilo Jane. Oh, terrific pass. Another goal! The lead grows to four now. A rampant display. Well, here's the goal again, and what a wonderfully weighted pass this is. And the finish is really good. She just smashes that past the keeper. That's a top-quality goal. A lopsided contest, 4-0. Well, we have 20 minutes left in this game. Very quick thinking there. Bodies forward, and the break looks on. Oh, good-looking run. Well, that challenge will mean the referee has to act. What's she going to do? Well, under those circumstances, any referee would really be put to the test. And in this case, a booking steward. Well, it's a difficult decision, but I'm with the ref here. No red card for me. Just wide of the target. Yeah, and I would say she's a bit unlucky. She's got to try and get it into the corner. It just bends away from the post. That's a good effort, though. Mbani. A move of promise on the flank. And a really fine piece of goalkeeping. Well, I'm not sure that was the right decision. Easy save in the end. Daniela van der Donk. Dominique Janssen. Oh, pressing really high. Beautifully disguised ball. And she's made the timely run. And off target in the end. And that'll be a goal kick. Well, they've been getting the substitute ready. And now they will make the personnel change. An example of how to press. Regain possession. Good technique displayed. Cleared away comprehensively. Badenstein. 
Deserves credit for winning the ball back. Well, doesn't have to do it on her own. Well, we are going to have a decent amount of stoppage time. Three minutes to be exact. We're getting right on top of their opponents and winning it back. Well, sadly, she's got that one horribly wrong. And if she had a chance again, I think she'd probably hit through the back of the ball rather than trying to chip it. That's a wasted opportunity. The sound of the final whistle confirming South Africa's progress. They're through to the quarterfinals. Well, the result was never in doubt, was it? They controlled the game from start to finish. They created numerous chances and they dictated the tempo. A very comfortable win.